Hold on a second. Hello, boss. I'm with him now. No, not yet. We're at a crucial point, though. Pretty sure I can pull this one off. I'll get a hold of you end of the day. Yeah, thank you. So you didn't tell him we've signed the contract? You wanted to play 18, didn't you? How am I supposed to concentrate with this kind of pressure? At American Spoon, we make what we believe to be the, the finest fruit preserves in the world. And in many ways, American Spoon is a family business. My son has uh, come back to Petoskey, thankfully, and is a great help in the business. He's our brand manager. Uh, my wife is a director of the company, and she works in our retail stores, and she's always been my, my model customer in, in deciding what our customers will like. If she likes it, our customers tend to like it. And uh, we feel like we've just had a very rare opportunity to raise a family in this beautiful place, in this beautiful town. Uh, we love the Four Seasons, the weather drama. No matter where we go, we're always thrilled to come home. And, uh, you know, there are very few places where you can recreate outdoors, do great things. It doesn't matter what time of year, there's always something you can do to enjoy the natural environment, uh, which is really one of the great assets of Emmett County. Several years ago, um, well 30 years ago actually, my husband and I decided to leave New York where we had been working in theater and come back to Michigan, um, primarily because we knew we wanted to raise a family, we wanted to be close to relatives, and he had summered in this area as a child. We found that there were many people in our age range who had come back, um, primarily because you had the advantage of being in a small town or living near a small town and the possibility to be outside and enjoy the seasons year round. So it was a great attraction um, to have that kind of lifestyle which seems to be in many cases disappearing. I do have a lot of friends that come to visit Northern Michigan and they're always uh, impressed with uh, how beautiful it is here and I, and I certainly encourage them to, to uh, seek employment opportunities here. There, there are certainly uh, jobs available and I think I think a place like this that's this beautiful uh, is a ripe environment for intelligent young people to come and, and build a life. Our slogan at Pond Hill Farm is we're the place for food, flowers, and family fun and we grow flowers, vegetables, and herbs. Um, we also do bedding plants, annuals, and perennials and then the family fun aspect has really been the part of the business that um, you know I guess is the most fun for us. People can come and they can pick berries, they can hike the trails, they can feed the farm animals, they can come and have lunch in our cafe. And it's become a place where families can come and spend a couple hours and have a family, quality family experience. I couldn't ask for, for any other place I'd rather be. Um, you know, both my wife and I enjoy windsurfing and we enjoy salmon fishing uh, out on the lake and playing tennis and going to the beach. And, um, you just couldn't ask for a better place to do all those things. And the other wonderful thing is how safe this area is. And uh, you, know, you don't have to lock your car. I mean, I guess most people do, but um, you know, it's just what a place to raise a child. Um, you get to know people. Mm -hmm. you, get, you get to know everywhere you go. You, you know people by their first name. And um, you know, you don't get that in, in bigger places. And, oh yeah. You know, it's certainly a, a positive thing, and you know, it's really a wonderful thing about it. I think I've met more people here in the last two years than I did in 10 years living in Arizona. Why wouldn't you want to live here? Yeah. <laughs> you know, you can be inside anywhere, mm -hmm. but uh, if you're going to be outside somewhere, um, you know, Emmett County is really a place to be. Speaking of, uh, you know, the quality of life in Emmett County and, and why do we choose to live here? I think that's the important thing. There's a lot of people that, uh, like myself, that uh, want to live up here and, and a lot of people that um, look for opportunities up here. Uh, the reason the hospital brought in I think 19 new doctors in the last year and a half is because they want to they want to live up here. They want to raise their family up here. They want to raise their children up here. I have many of my friends, my neighbors who are still actively in business all over the world. And uh, a lot of people now, because of the technology we have and also the technology that will be there tomorrow, will be uh, able to um, have the best of both worlds, taking God's gifts and our dreams 
what this will be a hundred years from now. And it's that simple. You know, Harbor Springs, Petoskey, Emmett County, we'll all be here a hundred years from now, 200 years from now. And what we do today is going to assure that everybody can have the opportunity that we have today, a hundred years from now. Every time I come home, I'm happy to be home. I don't come home going, oh gee, oh gosh, I wish. I am so thrilled to be home, particularly flying into Pelston, where you come out of the clouds and you begin seeing the lake regions and all of the beautiful lakes, the different colors in the lakes, and you land at this gorgeous airport that, in fact, when it opened, I was biking by and went in in my bike clothes and was sorry that I was there in my bike clothes because I needed to be in a coat and tie. It's that nice. It's the natural resources that are here. That's why it's important to take care of these natural resources, what we have here, opening up the curtains, turning the TV off and looking outside. What more could you want?